Thanks, Alexandra. The Tulsa County Sheriff's Office is on the hunt for the owner of a rare boa constrictor. Deputies rescued the likely escaped pet in West Tulsa when it wound up on a frightened neighbor's porch. I went out to Safari Sanctuary today, which is taking the snake in at least for now. These pictures shared hundreds of times on Facebook after Deputy Adam Bivens rescued a feisty albino boa constrictor off a rural West Tulsa porch. Uh, he's a little angry and irritated when they're not in their own natural habitat. They kind of get startled and defensive. We're all bigger than it, so it looks at everything as a natural predator. I own two ball pythons. So I'm a little comfortable dealing with snakes when other people aren't. Bivens brought the snake to Lori Ensign, who has dedicated her life to Safari Sanctuary, caring for numerous exotic animals like tigers and reptiles. That is why we exist, is to take in animals that people, people can't handle. Lori says it's likely the snake escaped due to its value. They'll be missing it because that's a minimum $500 snake. Um, Unless they're, you know, they're the breeders and they just had excess or something. She showed us how large some of these snakes can get because many potential pet owners don't realize it until it gets too expensive to feed and house them so people get rid of them by dumping them. However, snakes like these wouldn't survive in Oklahoma. The minute uh, the cold hits for more than two or three days, it's going to get a respiratory infection and then eventually die. Deputies are hoping to find the snake's actual owner, but unfortunately they've already received nearly two dozen calls from people trying to claim the reptile, so they're asking for proof. Safari says the good thing about snakes is that each of them typically have individual markings, so they should be able to tell who the rightful owner is if they have photos. In the meantime, safaris will quarantine the snake for a while to make sure it doesn't spread any unknown illness or disease to the other reptiles on the property and remain in a safe space as long as necessary. So if the snake belongs to you and you can prove ownership, you can call the Tulsa County Sheriff's Office.